Hi, in this video we're going to show you how to add some additional templates to Google Docs. So if you open Google Docs and you go to the template gallery, you'll see various templates here in various categories. But none of them are super exciting. You know, some aren't bad, but for the most part they're kind of plain. So what you could do if you want some more free templates, you could install the Google Docs templates by CloudHQ. So CloudHQ does all kinds of extensions for Chrome and Gmail and that type of thing. Uh, so we're just going to click on Add to Chrome. This should work for Edge 2. Add the extension. Okay, so now we have our extension here. We could pin it for easy access. So now let's go back just into Docs itself. Let's just say we're in a new blank document here. So if we click on the Google Templates button here, it'll open up the Templates by Cloud HQ section that you still have your general section with your default templates. So, so now we have all these as well, various categories. Actually quite a few of them compared to what comes with Google Docs. This keeps going and going. All right. So let's just pick one. Let's pick this one here, just for fun. So now ask if you'd like to make a copy of it to put it in your Google Docs and also in your Drive. Okay, so now you see we have the template loaded and we could just edit it as needed. So now if we go back to our main Google Docs here, now we have it under our recent documents. Then we could open it later to continue working on it. And then even if you're in something like Gmail, you'll still have your option here for the Google Docs templates. And you can just click on it and take you right to Google Docs, right into the uh, templates by Cloud HQ. And then you could just pick one and continue working on it from there. All right, so I will put a link in the description where you could download this. Uh, you might have to sign up for a Cloud HQ account. I'm not sure if I have one. Um, if so, it's a good thing to do because they have all kinds of uh, extensions and apps you could use. And then once you have an account, it's easy to manage them. You just have your Cloud HQ setting here. And you could manage your apps. And then you could check out all their other apps that are available as well. Okay, so once again, I'll put a link in the description, then you could try it out for yourself and see how you like it. All right, thanks for watching, and be sure to subscribe.